Hello everyone, this is Creative Bio. Today, we will talk about drug-resistant tumor cell. Cancer is the second cause of death in the world, with 12.7 million new cases in 2012 and 8.8 .8 million deaths in 2015. The number of new cases is expected to increase by about 70% in the next two decades. With the progress of tumor prevention and treatment, the survival rate of cancer patients has been improved. But there was a new phenomenon, cancer drug resistance. Why does cancer drug resistance arise? There are several mechanisms that are discussed. First, tumors are very heterogeneous, which suggests that a pre-existing subpopulation of cells might be the originator of the development of acquired therapeutic resistance. Second, host factors such as pharmacokinetics of the drug, alterations in drug metabolism, drug absorption and intracellular drug transport and tumor cell factors can both cause drug resistance. Third, Overexpression of one or more drug efflux pumps in cancer cells can cause multi-drug resistance. Next, the phase of the cell cycle can determine response to a given drug. Indeed, cytotoxic agents which target cancer cells in the S-G2-M phases of the cell cycle killed the proliferating cancer cells at the surface of the solid tumor only, having reduced effect on quiescent cancer cells. Other causes of drug resistance include increased DNA damage repair and tolerance to DNA lesions. The methods employed to identify drug resistance mechanisms and novel therapeutic targets depend greatly on the establishment of cancer drug resistance cell lines. The establishment of such drug-resistant cell lines is laborious and time-consuming. A few studies use drug-resistant cells from clinic directly, although this approach has high reference value. But high cost, poor repeatability, sources of instability, short survival time in vitro were greatly limits its widespread application. So how to build resistant cell lines? Drug-resistant cell models are developed by pulsed or repeatedly exposing cancer cells, growing in cell culture to drugs. Cells from a sensitive cell line at priori are usually cultured in the presence of increasing drug concentrations during a prolonged period of time, allowing the selection of resistant cells that proliferate well and tolerate the presence of the drug. In this situation, the resistant and sensitive cell lines contain the same genetic background since they come from the same cell-based origin and differ only in the resistance mechanism acquired for the specific drug. The starting concentrations of the drug required to develop a resistant cell line vary, as well as the applied approaches. Some authors have used either the IC20 or IC50 concentration of the drug, or even a non-toxic concentration, to start generating a resistant phenotype. Then different approaches have been employed, I, a continuous increase in the concentration of the drug over time. 2. A second and final increase in the drug concentration. Or 3. Maintaining the same drug concentration. This process is inexpensive, but it is quite time-consuming. In addition, different drug incubation times have been used. One way, the cells were cultured continually in the presence of the drug. Another. The cells were treated for short periods of time, pulse treatment. Me Transfecting multi-drug resistant protein in tumor cell is a reliable method to generate drug resistant cell. With the characteristics of short time, high resistance and stability. Isolation of surviving clones derived from parental cells is another method. 
but this approach relies on the ability of the cells to grow independently from each other. Because single clones are isolated, different mechanisms of resistance are expected to develop in different clones. The reference regarding the methodology of the development process is little and exploring a suitable selection strategy and finally generating stably drug-resistant cell model can be very time and energy consuming. Creative BioArray provides a one-stop shop services to assist your research. Looking forward to cooperating with you.